Um, I'm actually going to just show you a pipe here, that one there. You can probably see the stoppers in quite a long way there. I actually had to refresh that pipe. For some unknown reason, I built the pipe wrong. Uh, we all make mistakes, and I like to admit mine. Um, I actually made it too short. So when I built the replacement one, I made it too long. <laughs> uh, Peter didn't do that with the first one, didn't he? Uh, so I've actually got to take that one out again and shorten that. Incidentally, all the pipes on this, uh, especially the ones on the front and, and the back row here, um, are actually pipes that um, I didn't name diapasms. Uh, apparently that's what they are. Um, they're all built out of proper uh, seasoned timber. It's actually an old uh, um, base pipe that I had off for another big organ that I broke up. Um, and I've actually used the materials off that to build it. These pipes, unlike normal uh, bordons, um, these bordons have actually got a hole right through the middle of the actual stopper. Hence the reason uh, for the broadness of the stopper and the length. So actually the length of the actual um, stopper is actually a part of the speaking uh, part of the actual pipe. It's not just a stopper. Uh, for decorative purposes, it is actually part of the le overall length of the actual speaking part of the pipe. So quite a tricky little thing I had to do to try and get them to, to step up and down like that and keep them in some sort of nice step. Um, the base pipes are closed board ons as normal, uh, three and a half foot being the base one here. Um, over the other side obviously you've got uh, four, uh, there's actually only four bases. Uh, the first four at the front are a part of the um, a company register um, and the melodies are all mixed up. Uh, I've actually swapped them around left to right so when you actually stood at front of it you can actually hear it swapping left to right and it's quite, um, well, it's different. The actual case is all made of MDF. Um, this is MDF, all the back, all the fascia, everything's MDF. Um, basically it's been uh, painted in a wood grain effect very similar to the Victorian scumbling effect except I know that was oil based um, and was a devil of the stuff to get off if you've ever lived in a Victorian house um, it's sometimes it's easy to just take the skirting board off and ditch it but anyway um, this is a nice um, um, paint effect um, it's not any particular one like the ones you can buy it's just normal um, does what it says on the tin paint um, varnish and basically just brushed on and up and down if anybody wants now it's done I'll give them a quick demo uh, on the video somewhere I might do one early later for you but anyway I hope you enjoyed that enough of my rantings and what have you and I'll switch off <laughs>